Hi guys and welcome to yet another very exciting Adobe Illustrator tutorial and in this tutorial I will teach you uh, what is the usefulness of the layer and how uh, how much it makes your job of selection and targeting different parts of the illustration in Adobe Illustrator for example look at this uh, illustration of vector heart which is pretty complicated and it has this texture in its form of dust or smoke I think it is if you for example want to select a part of it it selects for example this texture or smoke and then it's different parts even if you go to direct selection tool it's going to select different parts and I want to select this part of the bike and in which I want to make a modification to its you know color I want this part of it to be selected but as you can see nothing is getting selected even if I turn off the whole layer which I know in this instance but other times you have to find it I turned off for example the whole layer of the you know which I made up that smoke or texture whatever it was okay that was applied on it but still it is really hard to select this bike area which I want to change the color of you know for example I want to change it or move it around or something like that you know whenever I select it it selects different stuff or different only different lines in it but if I go to uh, selection tool then I click on it it selects the bike or the body of the tiger also and stuff like that there well, is a easier way if you can select it if you find know about it you know if you find out where your part is or you can see it of course in the small icon that are given here of course you can increase its size if you do not see it really well and if you mess it up too much you can always go to the essential workspace here and reset your you know workspace you do not have to worry about increase its size once so that you can see the icons clearly once you find out that where your target thing is for example this is our place I have found it the bike area or the layer of it then there are uh, you know, to its right there are two icons only the square circular icon which says click to target if you click it it's going to target it and then there is another icon here which is not visible but if you click on it uh, there is a little square blue icon appears and that it selects that place it is also targeted of course you can target it and it also indicates it and it's I indicated and targeted now now any change or any effect now from all now that you apply from your panels color panels or wherever paint panels is going to be applied only to this layer because this is the one that is targeted nothing else will be affected in here of course that is if you made another selection then it the selection would go there but selecting things and isolating things from the layer panel is much more easier than selecting with the selection tool or direct selection tool directly because you do not know the, that which line belongs to which uh, item now it is isolated all the lines and it is just given me the stuff that are inside and especially i want to emphasize on this part that because all these lines the other lines the black ones the highlights they are not part of the structure of it you know they are just highlights on top of this layer that i want to change the color of that's why it's even more useful i just want to change this the color of this uh this brown or yellowish i don't know which stuff okay this is brownish type of a color i want to change this i don't want to change the color of these you know other lines and stuff but if i use the selection tool you know for example like this then what happens i get those selected in front instead of it maybe sometimes you are lucky you can get selected but targeting things here like with these icons and indicating them it's much more safer and much more easier now you can go to color guide and for example i want to change this bike into a pinkish color because pink is the color of scooters because it is used by girls it's a girly color okay this light pink okay this light pink works for me it did not work for me for the little sister that I have, you know, imaginary little sister. I do not drive bikes, scooters, I ride choppers. Oh yeah, you know, that big game type of motorcycle. Of course, I never have that. Okay, so guys, as you can see, selecting and targeting things with the layer panel is such a joy and ma makes your work so much easier. 
with that said i conclude this tutorial and hope to see you in the next tutorial in which i will even bore you more to death okay so bear with me the cool stuff is coming okay until that time i take my leave from you guys goodbye